Hello friends, in story time at Kadambavanam, today we will see the story of Rudra Pasubadi Nayanar. In the fertile land of Chodas, watered by the holy Kaveri river, there was this town of Tirutalayur. It was a town filled with holy people. Sekidar describes that the priests and the Vediyars in that town were always involved in sacrificial ceremonies and hence the rains were benevolent on Tirtalayur. The cattle there offered their Panjakavyam of their own accord for the worship of Lord Shiva. Panjakavyam is made of milk, curd, ghee, the cow's urine and cow dung or milk, curds, ghee, butter and buttermilk. So this was considered to be very sacred. Even now we use it in worshipping the lords through various rituals. The people of the town lived a life of righteousness and kept up the goodness of Tirutalayur. In such a community was born into priesthood Pasupati Nayanar. He kept reciting the Rudra Jabam which is found in the Yajur Veda four times a day. And how did he recite it? He got into the cool waters of the holy pond that was there and stood neck deep in water and focused his mind and heart on the Lord's lotus feet and continuously chanted the Sri Rudram, hence the name Rudra Pasubadi Nayanar. Thus he lived a simple life dedicated to the Lord and this pleased our Lord Shiva so much that he came down from the heavens and blessed Pasubadi Nayanar and made him come with him to Kailash reciting the Rudram. This story proves that by simply focusing our heart and soul on the Lord and doing mantra jaba, one could attain salvation. This is the story of Rudra Pasubadi Nayanar. We will meet next time with yet another story from the Periyaburanam in story time at Kadambavanam. Vanakkam.